guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl tupo if you're new here welcome 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 please subscribe like comment give me a thumbs up guys today i'm going to show you how to achieve this gorgeous silk press look using one pack of braiding hair so if you guys want to see how i achieve this look please continue watching guys my hair is already washed and moisturized i'm going to be using my rat tail comb my scrunchies and my hair clips to achieve this look so what i'm going to do is i'll start by sectioning my hair from the center of my head exactly the way i'm doing so once i section out the hair from the middle of my head i'm going to secure one of the sides using a scrunchie and i'm going to start working with one side sis all right so i'm going to take my rat tail comb again and then i'm going to section out a straight line going all the way to the back and then i'm going to use my hair clips just to hold the rest of the hair out of the way that way i can work with that little section that i just sectioned out sis okay so once i do that i'm just gonna start braiding my hair going all the way to the back so just corner sis all the way to the back you already know i already have a tutorial on how you can achieve corners by yourself okay so i'm going to put the link in the description below so once you're done watching this video you better go and watch that video as well so that you can learn how to corner your hair by yourself sis okay so i'm going to do the same exact thing section out my hair and then i'm going to use my hair clips just to hold the rest of the hair out of the way that way i can just work with that little section okay so once you're braiding by yourself this is very important okay you better make sure you're holding the hair out of the way that way you know you don't get confused sis all right <laughs> very very easy very beginner friendly anybody can actually do this all right can you guys believe we're already in november what oh my gosh i'm over here like where did the time go and this just reminds me guys i forgot to tell you it was baby Kylie's birthday and she just turned one guys where did the time go she's over here standing and trying to walk and stuff this year just flew by i cannot even comprehend honey how we came from january to november like what it was just a blink of an eye and uh, we are in november what oh. but i'm so excited about christmas you already know it's my favorite time of the year yes okay anyway sis so i'm just gonna do the same exact thing braiding my hair going all the way to the back I just want to do a middle part for this hairstyle okay make sure you pre-section out the middle part and make sure it's nice and straight and juicy or whatever once i'm done braiding all the way down i'm just gonna take this super grow hair and scalp conditioner and moisturize my scalp the braiding part takes me about 20 minutes okay if it's gonna take you longer don't worry about it you know you're learning how to do this that's fine okay don't worry about the time all right so i'm going to be using this basic crochet needle just a basic basic crochet needle i'm going to be using the expression here this is the pre-stretched color number one expression here it is 32 inches it does come three in a pack and i'm using all three sis and i wanted it to be really nice and short because i wanted it to look like i have a silk press on my natural hair okay anyways i'm just gonna take it out of the pack and then i'm going to start sectioning out the pieces that i'm about to use so i'm just gonna section out little pieces as i go along sis take the crochet needle place it in open the hook take the crochet here place it on the hook and then pull it out so once i pull it out i'm just gonna take the crochet here again and place it into the little hole right there and then pull it out and give it a little tug that's all i'm doing sis this right here when i tell you it is one of the easiest styles that you can ever do and it's going to come all the way through and you can actually do this with some curly hair straight hair wavy hair i mean this technique right here is going to work every single time okay but while i'm still talking sis have you subscribed to my channel don't forget to turn on your notification button so you do not miss out on any uploads because this channel is getting what juicy yes sis. i'm going to take the crochet needle place it in take the crochet hair the braiding hair place it on the hook and then pull it out 
Once I pull it out, I'm going to open the little hole right there. Take the crochet hair, place it into the hole, and then pull it out and give it a little tug. That's all I'm doing right there, sis. Very, very easy, very beginner friendly. Anybody, when I tell you anybody can do this, believe me, because a lot of people are like, Tupo, you always say these styles are easy. Yes, sis. These styles are so easy that you know what? You can actually do this in your sleep, period. <laughs> But yes, sis, you can't say you have failed until you give this a try. Hey, 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 hey. Today's shout out goes to all of my new subscribers. Thank you guys so, so much for subscribing to my channel. Thank you for rocking with me. Thank you for all the love. I cannot believe we are here today. Oh my gosh. Let's get to 1 million subscribers because baby, at this point, it is up from here. But make sure you're sharing these videos with your cousins, your besties, your mamas, and your aunts because sharing is caring. You already know. You don't want to be the only one who knows how to braid. You don't want to be the only one who knows how to style, sis. You don't want to be greedy. Share these videos because it's a whole lot of videos. I mean, 300 and something videos. You better make sure you binge watch all my videos, sis. And then you can actually choose a style that you want to rock this week, next week, the other week. You know what I'm saying? Like, ah. I'm going to take the crochet needle, place it in. Take the crochet hair, the braiding hair, place it on the hook and then pull it out. Once I pull it out, I'm going to open the little hole right there. Take the crochet hair, place it into the hole and then pull it out and give it a little tug. So I'm only securing it one time, but if you want to, you can secure it twice. One time is okay, but if you want it to be really, really, really secure, you better make sure you secure it twice, okay? But one time is fine, it's not going to unravel. It is just going to be really nice and cute or whatever. So I'm going to show you guys how I'm going to be doing the illusion in the middle. Like this hair grew on my scalp. Like this is my natural hair and Miss Tupo One just got a silk press or whatever. So I'm just gonna take the crochet needle, place it in and then take the braiding hair, place it on the hook and then pull it out. So once I pull it out, I'll have the little hole open. So I'm just gonna take one of the strands and then place it into the hole and then pull it out. And I, when I flip it over, it is going to look like it is growing out of my scalp, sis. Okay, so what I do is as I'm going along, I just take my hair clip and make sure, you know, I'm keeping the hair out of the way. That way nothing gets in the way, sis, cause I'm trying to get cute out in the streets, period. <laughs> So let me show you guys again, okay? So I'm just gonna take the crochet needle, place it in, open the hook, take the braiding hair, place it on the hook, and then open the little hole. Take one of the strands and then place it in. And then once I do that, I'm just gonna give it a little tug. And that way, once I flip the other side over, it does look like it is growing out of my scalp. It looks good, it looks good. That's all I'm doing right there, sis. Very, very easy, very beginner friendly. Anybody, when I tell you anybody can do this, believe me. Look at the middle part right there. It looks really, really nice. It looks like Miss Tupo One got, uh, you know, I got a sewing or I just have like a silk press kind of situation, okay? I'm taking this time to thank each and every one of my subscribers for all the love that you have shown on my channel, for sharing my videos, for watching my videos, for all the love. All right guys, so once I'm done, I'm just gonna take my mousse and make sure I lay the hair on the top right there. This style right here is so easy that it's gonna take you less than an hour and you will be out of the door. And if it takes you longer than an hour, that's fine too, sis, cause don't worry about it. Don't worry about the time as long as you are looking cute out in the streets, period. <laughs> And then I'm going to take my scissors and cut all the flyaways and try to shape it a little bit. I love that this hair is pre-stretched. I don't have to do too much, okay? All I wanted to do is just to make sure I just layer it just a little bit. That way it looks like, you know, it is actually my natural hair. And then once I'm done, I'm just gonna take my Kiss Edge Fixer and lay my baby hairs. You already know we gotta make sure we lay these baby hairs even though I'm not gonna be putting it up. 
And then I'm just going to take my styling strip and make sure everything is nice and laid and situated. All right, so once I'm done, I'm just going to take my sassy silk scarf and make sure everything is laid and situated, okay? You better make sure you check us out. Buy a scarf or two, and I'm going to show you guys how you can rock all these scarves. One of the ways is like this right here. You can actually rock it with a bikini, matching bikini. And baby, when I tell you, this silk press look came all the way through. Yes, sis, I am loving how natural this hair looks. It looks like my hair grew overnight. When I tell you I am feeling myself, I look good. I look good. I look like bae. Hell. <laughs> Let me know in the comments below if you guys are feeling this. Let me know if you guys are going to be trying it. Let me know if you guys think this is a hot style or whatever. Anyway, you guys can see the length. It is nice and short. I am just loving how natural this hair looks. And you already know I gotta give you another option on how you can rock this style. I'm just gonna pull two little pieces to the front and then take the rest of the hair to the back and use a scrunchie to secure it. And bam, bam, when I tell you I am feeling this style as well. Let me know in the comments below if you guys are feeling it. Let me know if you guys are going to be trying it. Let me know if this style is going to be it for the winter because you want something, you know, something that's going to keep you warm, sis. Okay. Anyway, thank you guys so, so much for watching my videos. Thank you so much for subscribing. Thank you for liking. Thank you for all the love. I cannot believe we are here today. Oh my gosh, let's get to 1 million subscribers. Because baby, at this point, it is up from here. But make sure you're sharing these videos with your cousins, your besties, your mamas, and your aunts. Because sharing is caring. And I will catch you guys in my next one. Bye!